hello welcome back in this lecture we will work on the view all products and this is more easier than the inserting anything because uh, we can simply view the data over here so for that we will uh, first of all go to I mean to this page index page and we will simply copy this whole thing this FSZ command will using control C I have paste it over here and we will say view if view underscore post view underscore product sorry products is active then uh, basically include a page which will be uh, sorry view underscore products that page will be there we have not created it but we are just going to create it very simply uh, create a new page and I will copy the default HTML tags to it or you can just simply leave it like that simply you can start from a table table width will be 795 align will be center and uh, table close you can also add bg color it will be pink control is to save this page uh, and save it inside the admin area with the name view underscore products dot php after that this is the first tr in which we will be adding some very simple stuff like uh, an h2 take we'll say uh, view all products here and h2 close so that in another tr we will add some th basically th takes if you are familiar with th that is basically used inside the table for table heading and there will be so many th for example for s and serial number and the se uh, second one will be title for the product and this will be image and uh, end, 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 end. We need to actually go to products table. What is there? Price is there, image is there, keywords are there. we just uh, can show the price and we will write uh, here edit and delete and this will be align center this tr it align center to it control is to save now can just come here just click view all products you can see this thing well uh, to the first one we will also say align center first year and uh, this td will be basically having some call spin will be something like Six. Control is to save. Press the page. You can see now. This is looking good. Uh, title, image, price. We can also add a border to this one also only. Border is equal to two. To this tr. <laughs> but there is no border <laughs> mm -hmm. 
anyways can add a beige color basically to this one beige color will be equal to black no then we will not see the text BG color we will use a uh, user user sky blue Control us to save now come here refresh the page so this is the BG color for this now <coughs> the second uh, TR here is very important where we will display the data dynamically from the database so inside the second TR we will uh, add TDs same like above there are six uh, TR uh, TH so we will add six TDs and before the TR we will start our PHP block and simply first of all include main the database db.php let me check yes db is there inside the db.php after that we will simply say uh, we will create a variable which will be get underscore pro is equal to write a query to select all from products I mean all products after that we will say run pro run pro is equal to mysqli underscore query and there is a connection variable and then get underscore pro that's it we have got them now inside a while loop we will create row underscore pro variable which will be equal to mysql either mysqli fetch array or mysql fetch associ or fetch array 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 is better because we will make an array so we can take any data we want and the reference is this variable and inside two curly brackets of this while loop we can just take data from this array because we are fetching the data from the table and all is that inside an array we have made it an array so inside the array there are there may be many records but we can take the details one by one the values one by one uh, by giving their names very simple like uh, we need for example pro underscore title product title is equal to we are getting this from the array and the name of the field inside the table is product underscore title you can see over here this I'm talking about product underscore title so that this is inside the array so we are getting that exactly by name we'll copy this we'll paste it once twice three four times the second thing is the image pro image and it will be product underscore image here as well third one is a uh, pro price it will take the pro price from here fourth one fourth one is what there is nothing we will delete this and uh, we will create a variable or here i which will be equal to zero and we will just make it here i plus plus inside the loop basically this is a very simple variable uh, with we started with zero and inside the while loop it will be it will go it will repeat again and again with the products uh, with the details so we just did edit it for the serial number so that is really simple understandable so as many records are there it will increment a number for them uh, we also could uh, you know retrieve the product ID because there uh, because we uh, deleted some products or maybe there are not uh, exact uh, numbering like one two three so therefore we did this simple i variable now in the inside the first td we'll simply echo i variable and uh, in the second this one we'll just 
echo the title pro title inside the third one we will echo mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. image pro image the third one we will echo pro price this one will simply create a link uh, index.php equal to uh, what is there yes edit edit underscore pro and we'll write edit and link close and in the last one we'll add another link where half is equal to delete underscore pro dot php and we'll write delete and link close so we added these two links because we will later on work out them if someone wants to edit the product or wants to I mean someone wants to do what edit product or delete products so that's it now we actually need to remove this curly bracket of while loop and actually to close it here after the closing tr so we will then receive all the data inside this whole tr table row because if we stop this while loop there then we will get only one uh, result or one record so we need to display all the records we have inside the table of products so that's it very simply this has been done the php work is very simple for this kind of things refresh the page and you can see i mean the serial number title image price edit links and things like that we can make it uh, we can simply make this tr a line center center tool is to save come back refresh the page no it's okay but one thing is there we actually need it to show the image instead of the text there so inside this this thing will uh, this uh, td we will just simply add img tag and its source will be products product underscore images backslash and that is the name of the image and then we will give a width of 60 pixel and a height of 60 pixel that's it control is to save press the page and you will see the images uh oh anyways we have these images of the products that we have on on our main website so we can simply edit them delete them and furthermore we can do whatever we want with them we'll increase the size on the height of these areas to 800 because we have some more products anyways this is something special and nice and very simple view all products we can see the title of the product the images of the products the price of the products and we can edit them delete them from here and the editing and deleting part we will uh, look at into in the next video tutorial stay tuned